Hello class, welcome to the Minute Math YouTube channel. Please hit the subscribe button below and share our videos. You can also find great math content and links to all of our videos at www.minutemathtutor.com. All right now, enjoy the lesson. Hi, I'm Sean Gant and this is Minute Math and today we're learning about multiplying, dividing fractions and mixed numbers and find each product. So, if I was given these numbers, negative 2 and 2 thirds times 4 and 1 over 10, okay? Well, first thing is I like to write these as improper fractions for multiplication. I always convert it. So, 3 times 2 is a 6, right? Plus 2 is 8. So, we have 8 thirds here, and that's a negative. Times 10 times 4 is 40, plus 1 is 41. 41 over 10, okay? So, now what I do is before I multiply these out and then bring it back down, I see 10 and 8 are both divisible by 2. Okay, so what I do here, okay, 10 divisible by 2 is a 5, and 8 divisible by 2 is a 4. That, I think, helps make it easier when we're doing our simplification later. Instead of multiplying larger numbers, I try to make them smaller before we multiply, okay? So just like we always do, multiply, here I'll do it across here, multiply across the numerator, all right, 4 times 41, well, 41 times 4, that's a 4, and the 4 times 4 is 16. So we have 164 here. Uh, yep. <clears throat> 164 over, and that's a negative, right? Negatives out there. 3 times 5 is 15. Okay? So now we want to bring this back down to a proper fraction. Well, how many times does 15 go into 164? So 15 goes into 164. 15 goes into 16 one time. 1 times 15, 15. Subtract them. 1, bring down the 4. Well, 15 does not go into 14, right? We got nothing there, so it's 0. 0 times 15 is 0. Subtract them, we have 14. Here's our remainder in a sense. So, our answer here, we know 10, or so this fraction, let me see how we bring it all together, right? This fraction, the negatives out front, 10 is what we have here, but then our remainder, which is 14, over 15, the divisor. And so we have our final answer of negative 10 and 14 over 15. So quick recap, we're given negative 2 and 2 thirds times 4 and 1 tenth. Well, I convert those to uh, improper fractions and we have them as such that I simplified a little bit and multiplied it out, got negative 164 over 15. Then, did some long division, so I times 15 goes into 164 to make this back into a proper fraction here, so, or mixed fraction. So, 15 goes into 164 10 times evenly. We have a 10 here with 14 left over. So 10, 14 left over, over the 15 down here. Negative, because it was a negative. So again, final answer, negative 10 and 14 over 15. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, the creator of Minute Math. And if you like this video, please hit the like button that's right there. If you have a mathematical question, just add it to the comment section below. And lastly, if you want to see more videos just like this one, hit subscribe. It's right there. But as always, thanks for watching.